Hey guys, it's Carrie. Lots of my favourite big cats. The leopard. Its fur is generally soft and thick, notably softer on the belly than on the back. It tends to grow longer in colder climates. Usually, leopards are larger in areas where they are at the top of the food chain without competitive restrictions from larger predators such as lions or tigers. The leopard has the largest distribution of all wild cats. It's found in Africa as well as the Caucasus and Asia. Leopards produce a number of vocalizations including growls, snarls, meows and purrs. The whitish spots on the back of the ears are thought to play a role in communication. Please subscribe and turn on notifications. Lion. Courtship may be initiated by either the female or male. They keep close to each other while consorting. The female exhibits restlessness. She lies down, jumps up and walks rapidly and rolls and twists on her back. The male follows the female at all times often resting with her. He may lick her neck, back or rump, which is uncommon behaviour outside of courtship. The male smells the female's urine to assess receptivity, which will invoke the feminine response when she is ready. Mating continues for a period of approximately three to four days. The female invites copulation by lordosis, which is a reflexive behaviour in fillets. Males may also initiate copulation. Mating occurs over several hours or over the course of a night. Copulations are brief but frequent, lasting a minute or less and may occur as often as three times per hour. Between copulations, the pair walks or lies down together. During copulation, the female purrs loudly or emits a deep growl. The tiger is an apex predator. It is territorial and generally a solitary but social predator, requiring large contiguous areas of habitat which support its requirements for prey and rearing of its offspring. Some tigers are now extinct and this would include three subspecies, the Balinese tiger, Caspian tiger and Javan tiger. All three have been extinct for at least 30 years. Living tigers include the Bengal tiger, Indo-Chinese tiger, Malayan tiger, Siberian tiger and the South China tiger. Tiger cubs stay with their mother for about two years before they become independent and leave their mother's home range to establish their own. The cheetah. There are some subspecies. The Southeast African cheetah, the Asiatic cheetah, Northeast African cheetah and Northwest African cheetah. The king cheetah is a variety of cheetah with a rare mutation for green coloured fur marked with large blotchy spots and three dark white stripes extending from their neck to the tail. The cheetah's closest relatives are the cougar or puma concolor and the jaguarundi. These three species together form the puma lineage, one of the eight lineages of Felidae. Black Panther. Melanism in the jaguar is conferred by a dominant allele and in the leopard by a recessive allele. An allele is a variant form of a given gene. If you look carefully you can still see the rosettes in their black fur. This is called ghost striping.
melanistic and non-melanistic animals can be litter mates. The melanism gene is a dominant gene in jaguars. A black jaguar may either produce black or spotted cubs, while a pair of spotted jaguars can only produce spotted cubs. The clouded leopard. It has rather short limbs compared to other big cats. Its hind limbs are longer than its front limbs to allow for increased jumping and leaping capabilities. The ocelot is usually solitary and crepuscular. This means it hunts at dawn and dusk. It scent marks its territory by spraying urine. The serval. It has a small head, large ears, spotted and striped coat, long legs and a black tipped tail. It has the longest legs of any cat relative to its body size largely due to the greatly elongated metatarsal bones in the feet. The Jaguar This spotted cat closely resembles the leopard but is usually larger and sturdier. You'll also notice that the rosettes have spots in them, unlike the leopard. The Jaguar enjoys swimming and is largely a solitary, opportunistic, stalk and ambush predator at the top of the food chain. As a keystone species, it plays an important role in stabilising ecosystems and regulating prey populations. Their fur is good for camouflage in the dappled light of its forest habitat. The spots in their shapes vary between individual jaguars. Rosettes may include one or several dots. The spots on the head and neck are generally solid, as those on the tail, where they may merge to form a band. The snow leopard, their small rounded ears help to minimise heat loss. The broad paws distribute the body weight for walking on snow and they have fur on their undersides to increase the grip on steep and unstable surfaces. It also helps to minimise heat loss. The mountain lion is also known as the cougar or puma, red tiger and catamount. It is the second heaviest cat in the new world after the jaguar. The mountain lion is more closely related to smaller felines, including the domestic cat. They are ambush predators and pursue a wide variety of prey. Please stay and watch another video with me. I love to read your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.